an update for what I've been playing with. Um, this little coil produces a field that I can feel if I put about three amps through it. And uh, the nail in the middle there is just for an iron core. Uh, I'm going to try rewinding this with an iron core on the inside of the coils. Anyway, I can feel the frequency out of this. It's very low. I'm putting in 60 cycles a second, so no surprise there. But it does seem similar to the field that my uh, pyramid puts out, only pyramids much higher feeling, whatever that may mean. If it's an antenna, well, then you can see about how big the, uh, the base of that is. Um, anyway, uh, these two fields definitely interact. I think this little one is feeding energy that then the other one converts to a higher frequency or something like that. Now, I tried detecting this field, so I uh, looked for the forward voltage in uh, diodes, and I tried all kinds of various diodes, high voltage ones, shot key, standard little ones, and none of them had any difference there at all. Uh, I know well, something like a compass can pick up this sort of field, but only at really low frequencies. 60 cycles per second is going to be way too uh, fast for a compass, so I'm still working on various detected detection methods. And if you're curious what I'm playing with, go to re the website remoteview.icu and uh, go look up Bob Greenier's stuff. Start with the bagel game post. Anyway, um, that's the update for now. Goodbye.